The last thing to do is open and close the hi-hat on every eighth note in the bar. This is significantly more challenging than moving the snare drum and bass drum, but it is essential to the style. All the snare drum and bass drum notes will be played as before. All the hi-hat open notes are going to be slightly loose, allowing the cymbals to sizzle, but not fully open so that they just ring. You can get the right sound by rocking your foot back and forth onto your heel, rather than picking your whole foot up. Use a metronome on eighth notes to center your rhythm, or on beats two and four to develop your even pulse. First, we're going to play eighths on the closed hi-hat, all four beats on the bass drum, and beats two and four on the snare drum. This pattern is going to repeat every two beats. Now, there are four places for the hi-hat to open, on or off the beat, and with or without the snare drum. This is usually a bit much to just jump into though, so let's break it down a little bit. The hi-hat can only open on or off the bass drum. If the hi-hat opens on the bass drum, then it closes in between. So we can count through all four beats of the measure and just observe this. We'll go one and two, three, four, one and two, three, four, one and two, three, four, one and two, and then the next one, one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, the next one, one, two, three, and four, one, two, three, and four, one, two, three, and four, the next one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one. If the hi-hat opens between the bass drum, it's going to close together. So we can count through all four beats and observe this. So we have one and two, three, four, one and two, three, four, one and two, three, four, one and two, next one, one, two and three, four, one, two and three, four, one, two and three, next one, one, two, three and four, one, two, three, and four, one, two, three, and four, and the last one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one. Now we can repeat all of this with the right hand, just tapping eighth notes on a rim or something with a really short sound. We're going to stabilize that time. Now we're going to count through each of the eight positions. So we'll be alternating between being in unison or being in between the hi-hat notes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One and two, three, four. One and two, three, four. One and two. Next one. Next one. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three. Next one. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One, two. Next one. One, two, three, four, and one, two. Last one, one, two, three, four, and 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 one. Now we can add the right hand on the hi-hat on all the eighth notes and hear how the hi-hat opens the eighth note before it closes in each example. You may find at this point your hi-hat does not exactly open at the right time to get the correct sound. A big part of this exercise is hearing and correcting for that. So we hear the eighth note open and sizzle the eighth note before it closes only. So now we're going to play all four beats with the hi-hat opening 
on the beat, so then the feet are going to be alternating bass, hi-hat, bass. It may be necessary to isolate that moment when the hi-hat opens in unison with the bass drum. So you can just go one, two, open, and then close it, and go one, two, open. Get that comfortable a couple times before you try to weave it in smoothly in time. One, two, three, four. Now we can play all four beats with the hi-hat opening off the beat, which means the feet will be closing together. Again, it may be necessary to isolate that moment, so you can go open, close, open, close, and get used to that feeling of everything lifting as you play open and then closing down together. One, two, three, four. Now we can play the whole exercise in order, opening on each eighth note at a time. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Next one. One, one, and three, one, and three. Next one, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Next one, two, four, one, two, and four. Next one. 